Hello everyone, today's tutorial is about color grading in cinematic style versus commercial style and learning how to do both. So without further ado, let's jump into Premiere Pro to start it with the cinematic one. As you know, cinematic image needs less contrast compared to commercials. It has a somewhat green tint and it's warm. The footage we have here is in log profile, therefore we need to bump up the contrast to make it look normal. And also increase the highlights and shadows for the same reason. Then some green tint as discussed and some black for the black parts to pop up. Then we change the general mood of the image to green, yellow or blue by changing shadow tint under the creative section. I change it to yellow to make our image look warmer. Now it seems like the image is too green, so let's reduce the green tint from here. And change the temperature from curves. Reduce some blue and also reduce the yellow from shadow tint a bit. And increase the contrast as well. Now let's give our footage a fake anamorphic look, like in the movies. To do that, I'm going to create an adjustment layer on top of the footage and add the crop effect to reduce the size from top and bottom. Perhaps 15 is good for that. Then reposition the footage in between black bars and our cinematic color grading is done. Now let's make our commercial look. I'll duplicate the footage and delete the previous Lumetri information. Commercial image needs to be sharp, with bold colors and high contrast, while keeping the image realistic. So the image shouldn't be moody like so warm or cold, or with intense purple or green tint, but instead, the color grading should be rather simple. So I'm going to give this image much more contrast, with more exposure and highlights. And also reduce the shadows to give it more light contrast. As you can see, the dynamic range of the image is a bit off, so I'm going to fix it by reducing the white amount and increasing the saturation so that the colors pop up more. This particular footage has got some green tint on its own because it's captured by a Canon camera, so we need to reduce it by giving the image some purple tint or using the white balance selector. But I'm going to do it manually by adjusting tint and temperature. Now let's boost the sharpness by increasing the sharpen under the creative section. In commercial color grading, you can play with shadow tint based on the needs of the project. For example, you can create a hot summer day for a cold drink commercial, or intensify the coldness of the image for winter. But we need our image here to be realistic, so I don't change the tint. I think a bit increase in red will also make it better, so I'll do it from the curves. And we have done our commercial color grading for this one. You can also choose the shortcut and use our professional LUTs to do it all in just 5 seconds. We have different LUTs for commercial, cinematic, music video and wedding projects. These LUTs are created in our color lab by professional software and can be used in Premiere Pro, After Effects, Photoshop, DaVinci Resolve, Final Cut and more. They can also be used for any image profile that your camera produces and get customized to your liking.
Links are as always in the description. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.